Hello, good morning. If you did not have what you were supposed to have in your advent calendar this morning, you are very lucky because you have gotten a Chipotle ranch instead. If we could have done all the products the same in the advent, we absolutely would have. However, we've had a few days we were either a bit short or we've had a product that we couldn't get ingredients for or we've had actually a product that managed to send two of our staff to hospital so we couldn't make any more. <laughs> so you have got a Chipotle ranch in your advent today and don't worry, this is no less than any of the other products. This one is exceptional and today we're going to make a cheesy queso cob loaf with the chipotle ranch. Just going to get a nice big saucepan, pop that on a nice medium low heat. 200 grams of sliced streaky bacon. While that's cooking we'll get the cob loaf ready. Any sort of nice round or oval loaf works fine. Take the top off and you're just going to hollow out this bread. Pop that on a lined oven tray. Get these bits of bread all around them. Once your bacon's crispy, you're gonna have one cup of evaporated milk. This is the evaporated milk. You'll find it near the reduced cream. One block of cream cheese. Turn your heat down a little bit. Let that gently warm through. You're gonna chop up some spring onions and some jalapenos. Once your cream cheese is all melted through, two cups of grated cheese. I'm using the Tex-Mex because that's got a really nice blend of mozzarella and tasty. Stir this in gently. Two tablespoons of that beautiful chipotle ranch. There we go. Oh, yum. It's not spicy, it's just got a beautiful smoky ranch flavour with just a slight touch of warmth. If you're worried it's getting too thick, add a splash more of your evaporated milk, spring onions and our chopped jalapenos. Look at that, absolute perfection. When it's all nice and smooth and melty, get your loaf back. You're going to take that beautiful filling, pour them straight on into that hollowed out loaf. A little bit more cheese on top because why not, we've taken it this far. You want to go into the oven at about 200 degrees for 12 to 15 minutes. You want it nice and hot and bubbly. You want these bits of bread just starting to get crisp. Here we go, straight out of the oven. How good does that look? Oh my gosh. Okay, so you get your bread, dip it in your queso. Oh my gosh, look at this. If you don't want to do it in a cob loaf, just make the dip and serve it in your casserole dish with a bag of corn chips. Perfect like that as well for another option. You can do it gluten-free that way too. This is the best cob loaf you'll ever make.